What we invent here isn't just good STEM education, we invent a culture. Who is your customer again? Teachers. Yeah. What might be a benefit of taking off a lens? What could you do if you open that up as an opportunity? Okay. So we have three years of an engineering pathway. Students will be creating their own startups and projects based on engineering challenges. So one of the really important parts that they'll be drawing from is the grand challenges. So look at the grand challenges and see what are one of these challenges that we can tackle through developing our own product and what does that look like? In our class, we integrate biomedical engineering, anatomy and physiology, and engineering principles to come up with global solutions to various global issues. I think that idea that we're able to apply the things we learn here to global situations and, and help uh, better other people's lives, I think that's the one thing that's really encouraged me to keep doing it. And even though it is hard, I think that mindset is that I can do this and I can help others. I think that's the biggest motivator. So this is a three-year interdisciplinary program in which the students are solving global challenges and integrating three years of science, three years of mathematics and technology and engineering. If I know why I'm doing the math, then it's a lot easier for me to like say, okay, I, I'm gonna need this in the real world. So it's, it's a lot easier for me to like pay attention. I know in the old math, I was always thinking like, what could I use this in real life for? Because it, it didn't really make any sense to me. So now it does and I think that really helps with the education process. The whole goal of the program is really to provide an opportunity for students to learn in an environment that mirrors or mimics real world applications. Our school in freshman year gives out packets about the global challenges of engineering and um, one of them was of course providing clean water to people. The grand challenges are embedded in their curriculum. It just, it really gives them a context. In a lot of developing countries, um, finding clean water is something that's really hard to do. We decided to create a device that measures incoming UV levels, and through that, in a model of a disinfection process, so that they're able to drink water safely and sound. Some students come here thinking that because we're a STEM school, that our language arts and our history programs are gonna be downplayed, or not as intense, or less demanding. And those are some of our most talented teachers, are the folks in the humanities. How many people in here read The Road? So what were some things that we talked about in the road? Why would a humanities teacher want to come to a STEM school? I realized that the school was going to be different and that the grand challenges were about not just what's happening in my four walls. What else can you think of that you've learned and why is humanities important to your time at STEM? The reason why you do technology and engineering and stuff is to help people and improve people's lives so without the humanities background um, that helps you understand the challenges of other people and connect with other people. That's actually an integral part of Grand Challenges is that it's not just we're doing great science we're talking about being great humans that's why Grand Challenges talks to me. We don't know what the jobs are going to be like when these kids graduate from college but the skills that they're developing here are going to be applied to any field that they want to go to, whether it's engineering or not. So we know that not only locally and nationally, but globally, there is a great need for students to be in STEM education, to then go on to college and to major and or minor in a STEM field. And then the end goal is to get into that STEM career so they can bring viable solutions to our global challenges that are facing all of us in this world. And the grand challenges for engineering is the gateway. It's the absolute gateway to teaching students about how to make positive changes and to affect humanity on a very positive level.